Listen, Black Falls, it is the biggest scam ever. Chinese do not hate blacks. Chinese do not hate Africans. Chinese do not hate Cameroonians. Chinese do not hate Nigerians. Chinese do not hate Ghanaians. I can go on and forth. Hello, hello beautiful people. Welcome to my channel. My name is Dominique and once again, you are most welcome to my channel. I know the title is a little bit cheeky, but it is not a clickbait. It is what I mean, really. And um, I will start with an African proverb, very simple. I know it's a Bamilike proverb. I'm a Cameroonian, okay? It goes, if you know somebody, then the two of you can live in peace. Let's start with the big scam. People are saying scam. Chinese did not really tell her how bad this Donald, if you do not know, I call it Donald because I'm sick and tired of bad things having female names. Okay, so this Donald, people are blaming China for not telling us how a thing is. Look, all of us, we saw the videos of Chinese building a, a whole big hospital in one day or three days, one week, whatever time. See, people thought they were building those things for 3,000 deaths or they were just building because the normal hospital they have. They were not using them or whatnot. Which you saw in the news how Chinese people were bound in their own homes, how they were reported. Like, it is the communism, they, they function differently. Like, when they give one advice, everybody is following. And if you are not following, anyways, <laughs> try. It is another system, it is another culture. It is everything is different there. Okay, that was the first point. Um, by the way, before you go on, be emotive and say, oh, this woman do not know what she's talking about. Hear me out. The arguments are there. Most of the time, we are the one, we Africans. We give the power to others to treat us less. Okay? To treat us less. What is a Nigerian forcing himself into a Chinese restaurant? Don't you have options? Okay, or our politicians are, are, are they have sold out the country. I'm not there to advocate for them. Like the two of me and politicians, we have another trouble, it's another wahala. Okay, but I will get to those people later. I want to talk to you individually. Like, let us have this conversation face to face. Okay, I hear arguments like. China economy is fragile, African can, we should ban, we have doctors. <laughs> I'm asking you people, you have doctors. Can you manufacture a spread cup <laughs> or an injection or a sugar, these stripes or whatever medicals, <laughs> utility you need? Let's say even injection needle. Don't you know that doctors uh, uh, the slaves of big farmer. Which big farmer is based in Africa? <laughs> they only come in the forest, take the, the, the enzymes or the molecules and come and sell it back and we buy it. We, we not, cannot, proud, cannot boast that we have uh, uh, doctors. Which engine? Say it's canal. Whatever is, is manufactured anywhere in Africa. Like made in Africa, we can do natality without Europe. Like we can do Pregnancies can just take that one. We have doctors. We have doctors. Like there is something about the Chinese. Let me tell you, people. There is something about the Chinese <laughs> abroad, abroad or everywhere. How what I've, I've um, lived, I've experienced. Everywhere a Chinese is, you will find another Chinese. Like Chinese people can live in a country without needing to have contacts or contacts to eat, like to order among them. They don't even need to speak. Most of them don't even speak the language <laughs> of the country they are living in. Not all of us like this. We will be speaking, speaking, speaking. The next thing you know, the people will say, and you are speaking without with accent. 
themselves they have 10 accent if you remember i did a video about uh, she, uh <laughs> people saying she, uh, <laughs> fantastic famous you emulate <laughs> she see Yemi accent so chinese people they don't depend on others like they are one nobody is left behind i'm going to take another example of um chinese studying in my uni I studied, there was there was a really a running gag, like all the dissertations of Chinese are the same. Either they are doing bachelor or, or, or masters, they are the same, meaning it is the same canva given to everybody. And everybody know, is using it, changing it, even if it is physics or social science of informatics, whatever, whatever. <laughs> this is funny, but it shows how they are like, it is like this. Nobody is left behind. How are the Cameroonians going to behave? The Nigerians, all of, I, I know, we know, we know us, we know, we know how we behave. Your African student friend, he is going to be your inch of competition. Like we are, we are going to start to fight our friend, our friend in the sense of black, before we even look at the other big picture. You are his inch. You are the one he wants to tackle. You are... Anyway, let me just stop there. I'm just giving you people my point of view, okay? So when you say we are, we need to... <laughs> we need to ban Chinese products. Drive them out of Africa. I'll just tell you people, look at Zimbabwe. Look at Cuba. Okay? There is nobody winning in, a, in an economical war. Everybody is losing, but... How big are going to be your loss or your losses, whatever? That is the question I want to ask. I do not say we, we are there with nothing to say on the table. We have the market. But how, how are we going to lost? Like Donald Trump with his, I wanted to say something, but at this point I have to censor myself. He tried to fight the Chinese economy. Covid is how far have you gone donald trump how far have you gone fighting the chinese economy like before you you know how he is now shouting and telling and people behind you say listen these are the ramifications like the people um voting for you they are going to be the first to feel that your decision and before you know he's quiet before you know you're quite he's quiet let us take this was oh, like that politician, the video of that Nigerian politician shouting at the, at, the, at, the, at the Chinese and collecting the passport of Nigerian citizen. I was just like, oh, look, I don't have a sister. I would have given it to you to marry if you need a bottle of whiskey. Like, I would say those are the leaders Africa need. And the other one back in Nigeria asking his homologue to come and talk and say, Look, we are not happy. But the next thing you know, backing, they are backing, 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 backing. Nothing more. Why? I will just answer with a, <laughs> a German <laughs> sentence. There are two things citizens do not know how it is made. Sausages and laws, meaning political decisions. So, Open your mind, open your head. The same person shouting and bossing and bragging is the same person who is not like, you can't even hear, you whisper when you can't even hear your, his voice. So there are, the, there are things happening behind the scene. If he were, he had the guts and that guts to talk that high and boss, and the same person is keeping down, know that there is something on the picture, you and I, we are not seeing at this moment, okay? So Chinese live abroad without having contacts with others. Everywhere you go, there is something Chinese town. Me, myself, I buy food from Chinese. African food I buy from Chinese people. Can you imagine? Anyways, let me count down. Everywhere is Chinatown. How many Africans are out? Have you heard African town? Have you heard... I don't even know. Call it Igbo town. Call it Bamilike town. Call it um, Beti town. Call it uh, uh, Maasai town. Have you heard it? 
Have you heard of it? So our answer or the answers of our fellow YouTubers to this matter is hate. Let me, let me just remind you of something. The last time Nigeria and SA, they were fighting and uh, because you, you know what I mean. It was a distraction. At that time, the black population was busy uh, fighting the other blacks uh, in, in the, the townships, uh, many Nigerians. And at that time, there were new contracts of the exploitation of mine exploitations going re, being renewed for the next 20, you know how many decades. So why you are busy with hate and telling people to hate and to, to, to cut the branches you are sitting or to buy their hands, feeding them. Things are happening. Things are happening. Back on this feeling of hate, let me tell you people. Hate is a feeling. I call it energy vampire. It's like when you, when you spend your energy with hate, where are you going to take the energy to grow, to hustle? Hustlers don't have time for hate. And that is what Chinese are doing. <laughs> People, <laughs> Chinese do not hate blacks. Chinese love Chinese, that is the point. So don't blame somebody who is loving himself to hating you just because he's not paying the black tax, meaning the pity tax, meaning the, the, the complaining tax, or uh, <laughs> each time you are complaining. No, he, he, he is busy building his fragile economy, as you people are saying that the, 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 the Chinese economy is fragile. Which economy in this world is not fragile? Every now and then decade, there's something happening. There's a crisis. Ten years. Let us go ten years from now. There was the crisis. So that is the point of capitalism. So don't say Chinese are fragile. We can fragile them. Where are, for where? Why are you standing? Donna was not even able. So it is nothing separated Africans. Well, we are going to make the uh, Chinese economy fall. Okay, good luck. Oh yeah, waka. So instead of preaching hate, preach the love of each other. Pre love your next Cameroonian, your next Nigerian, your next African. Because we are the first to hate ourselves. We spend our energy hating each other. And we think the only thing the other person can do to us is hate. Whereas he's only following his interests. We all know of one of uh, a, a black border. As soon as he starts concentrating on himself, building self-love, making sure that he is kind of putting the foundation for the sustainable development, all of a sudden, you, you start to hate him and say, oh, he's not, you are no more. That is how we do. Our language is hate. And we mirror it and we think each and everybody around us, his own language is hate. Don't hate somebody who is puzzling. Because he, he, he doesn't even have that energy to, to give you the head back. He is busy hustling. Hustlers, builders, they don't have time to hit. They don't have that energy. It is not in your mind. It is not on your vision board. Call it how you want. They are too busy progressing, building, loving each other. They don't have place to hate. So if your language is hate, keep hating. And that is how you are giving the power to others to treat you less. Because your, your response is always hate. Love, the, love your black, whatever, whatever business you are doing, if you get in a company, don't, don't, don't let people use you to know what is going in the head of the other black co-worker. If you are studying, and your senior, your junior comes to ask for something to help him or her push in that study he's doing. Don't hide it because others, they are, they are sharing like, like smarties, like it is sasaye. If you are doing YouTube and your fellow was so not black, whatever, needs your help, your advice, a cooperation, a collaboration, or what so not. If you can't help with something, help with another thing. Help, love grow together let me repeat myself chinese do not hate black people chinese love themselves
and after they love themselves, they still love themselves. And after they, they still love themselves. And after a marathon, I mean, how many miles? Then then comes money, like capitalism. So you are not on their picture of hate or even love. Take it out you want, how you want. They are busy building. And yes, they can afford to make Nigerian personal non grata in their own restaurant in Nigeria. Because they don't rely on your market. They don't rely on your money. Or because they know the rules the gov government is giving you people. You are only going to follow. But them themselves, they follow the rules like <laughs> it is a law. How many, how many uh, uh, YouTubers have been complaining that the, 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 the rules, people are not following the rules about, uh, about the isolation, market things too meta, is nothing. Don't take your, 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 I would say nonsense, I wanted to say nonsense, but it's not nonsense. Don't take your way of looking things and just copy paste on the other ma people's mind. Like they are not on that page. They are not on that your page of hate. They are not on that your page of banning. They are not on that your page of burying an economy. They are the page of loving themselves. They are the same of finding partners and cooperation, using others, call it like that. And they are the page of building and growing, making money. You make money, I make more. That was me for today. If you understood, relate, or whatever my words woke <laughs> meant in your, your brain, let me know in the comment section. Subscribe to find me next time you are looking for me. And for now, stay curious as I always say, and love each other. Bye! Mwah.